Uh, first off, I um, want to talk about the trade we made today where we traded Keith Ollie for Carter Ashton. And uh, from our perspective with Keith Ollie, we're uh, trading away an asset we think is going to have a real good NHL career. He's big, he can skate, he's a great kid. And I want to thank Keith for what he did for us as a member of this organization and wish him well. He's a good man. Uh, with Carter, uh, we feel we've got some depth on D and we felt we needed to add some size with foot speed up front. He's a big body guy that can skate. Uh, he's got some finish. He's also got some sand. And from our perspective, uh, this is a player that's going to be an important for, and player for us down the road. Uh, our scouts have been pushing this guy on me for a while and uh, we were able to make those pieces come together. Uh, we feel the emergence of a couple guys with the Marlies as well as a couple of the draft picks we've had in the last couple of years uh, made this trade, trade possible, give us enough depth on D to justify the trade. Uh, as far as the deadline goes, um, I think you all know I don't like the trade deadline. I try to do my deals in advance, so this process began uh, in earnest for us about eight weeks ago where we tried to identify an opportunity to add to our group. Uh, we weren't able to do it coming into the deadline and we weren't able to do it today. We had numerous opportunities to trade players, um, numerous offers on players that would have involved futures, draft picks, guys down the road, and we feel we've worked too hard in the last three years to add organizational depth uh, to change that blueprint right now. Uh, we're on the lookout for something that can make us better and add to the group, but it didn't materialize. And I think some people will be disappointed in that, but I'm not. Uh, from my perspective, all the teams that we're chasing or are in the hunt with us took people out of their room and brought people in they thought could do the job better. We elected not to do that. So if I'm a member of the Leafs, I look at this as an endorsement uh, from uh, management that this group is capable of making the playoffs. And uh, you know, I didn't want to take a guy who'd been with us and sweat it all year and uh, replace him with someone else and say thanks for all the hard work, thanks for getting us in the hunt but I'm um, shipping you out. So we got numerous, numerous offers. Um, usual suspects, all the ones you read about, uh, but we've worked too hard to get these guys here. And despite our recent stumble, we believe in this group. And we believe that this group is capable of making the playoffs.